This is the fifth story from the Gateless Gate on Zen Flesh, Zen Bones, written by Paul Trips. Kyogen mounts the tree. Kyogen said Zen is like a man hanging in a tree by his teeth over a precipice. His hands grasp no branch, his feet rest on no limb, and under the tree another person asks him, Why did Bodhidharma come to China from India? If the man in the tree does not answer, he fails. And if he does answer, he falls and loses his life. Now what sh shall he do? <laughs> Zen Shastra. As the Indian the Namda Dhyana Abhyasa Markunda. Bodhi Dharma Nail Bittu Buddhist monk China Nail Bittu Vandhu Raji Kogi Alli Hogi Dhyana Heli Kodakke Hovaga Alli Da Ii Chinese Jana Ki Da Barala Adi Ki Avaru Da Dhyana Nail Avaru Cha Dhyana Nail Avaru Cha Nail Avaru Cha Eh Dhyana Pa Nail Cha Angi Avaru Cha Bandhi Alin the Japan Nili Hoga Japanese Janaki Chabarala or Chanil Zanil, Chanil Zan, Angel Zen Bandi. You were in Madidu Takonda Samagri Purify Madidu. Nam the Dianu, China Nili Hogi Dashin, other coating complete changes Madidu over the circumstances. Koskara. All in the Japan, our new pure Shuddha mode is Zen in the Most purified form of philosophy or religion is called Zen. Namda Rajanili, Namda Kainili, Samagri Kotra, Ade it called Puja Murti. But our Ade it called Puja Murila, our Samagri, Mane, one of the shells, Mane Nili. Tarkari tan koti do, ejwan tarkari tan koti do. He inti ko. Tan kotra na nadi kya marthi nin. Aavon do mind. Tan kotra. Government ko, anke reservation kotra kalsam marthi. Government ko ration kotra na tin tin. Aavon do mano ba aur atra dilla. He inti ko tarkari koti dakshana. He inti ko ta gatte. Aar tarkari nam do mani nili bills bikhu. Aavon do da garden hai tu. Aavon aur kotta hai tu. Oh, let thy food be thy medicine. Hippocrates said, Oh, the food is Aushadi bandidu. So, Aushadi matra, Aushadi kidagil gudi belsa ke try modi tu. Aushadi kidagil, Aushadi kos kira illa. Adho, spring, summer, autumn, winter nili, yaw the food, adhiya maadu dhe jara barala, aroge chana girti in gudi, ah, mani inti karta itu. Adho karna ali, chan and zen bandidu. From India, Bodhidharma, one Buddhist monk, went to China. He took our dhyana and he taught them dhyana in China. But Chinese people cannot pronounce dha, so they said cha, so it became chan. When the Chinese took it to Japan, Japanese couldn't say cha, they said za. So it became Zen. And what this, these two people did, they always purified what we are given. So it is called the most purified form of philosophy or religion, what is called Zen. For an example, I used to hear these stories in India, especially from the ladies' part. They say, if the man in the house, the husband brings it, I will make it. But in, if it is Chinese or Japanese, if the husband brings the vegetables, she will immediately make sure that vegetable is grown in the house. It cannot be bought in the shop because you cannot trust the shop people because they put a lot of chemicals. And that is ill health. What is grown, what love is grown in the house. And when she grows the medicine plant, she understands what Hippocrates said, let thy food be thy medicine. In the food itself, there is medicine. So she makes sure that she grows a kind of 
vegetables, greeny leafy vegetables, which can be both sides. It can be food, and the food itself is medicine. And she makes sure that spring, summer, autumn, winter, she's so much intelligent. That intelligence came because of the freedom, total love and freedom given to the house lady in Chinese, China and Japan. I think the problem in India was because of the invasion, because of the um, subjugation by a thousand years by the foreigners. Our, our men suppressed our women, did not allow them even to think. Every time the women opened the mouth, they said, shut your mouth. Your mouth is big. Hence, they thought maybe the man knows everything, but the man is always a child. He's not even childlike, he's childish. And that childish and the suppression at home must have created the destruction. Here, Zen is like a man hanging in a tree by his teeth over a precipice. When the Marana lay, Halanelli Kachkondo Yerdukai Yerdukalu Catch Mark Yaudila Adinilinga Hang Murder on the Manisha Zen means again Avoga Kalagada in the Kalagada in the Opa Kelter, Shastra Kelter, Namda Janagulo Shastra, Devsana Hogi Shastra Kalako, Gurukalatra Shastra Kelder. Adrumeli, a Gurukul, any hair is at the Matra Matbuiko Gurukul Vandu, finger point modre, a Berlutakon Puja Modi the Shastra, a Berlutakon to Ali Nelitra, Ali Hogila, by a birther, Nin Jodeba, Jodeba. In London, the Zen Nelit, the finger pointing to the moon, Nodapa, the Chandra, and Elwaga, Ella Makra, Berlutakon Puja Muridene Chandra, no Chandra, Lipa. So, the Shastra Bodhidharma already Gurukul Kelter, Manishir Kelter, and an integral Kelter, Bodhi Dharma, China Nili Yaki Bandidu. Nino answer Madilandu in failu. Nin answer Madre in Kalara Bidis Atogate. In 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 Madu, Kamarakagate. Zen is like a man hanging in a tree by a street over a precipice. That means you are on your own. You will not have your father and mother to hang on, grasping over your father and mother, over your religion, over your caste, over your political leaders. The moment you hold on, you become a slave. Because if you leave your hands, you will fall down, you get frightened. If you hold on tight, you lose it because it stinks. Hence, they were trying to bring that into this system.